I want to show you the MX-1 right now a little bit, just to sort of uh, briefly walk you through the, the, the sort of concept between, behind this. So uh, basically it's a way to sort of unify uh, all of your DAW tracks with uh, the IRA gear. Uh, and I can uh, and also add effects on, stop, uh, on top and there's step-based step uh, sequencer effects. So for instance, uh, I have... I have some tracks running from Ableton and I, at the same time I have my uh, IRA gear synchronized. But what, what really makes it very special is that I can actually connect my IRA gear with just a USB cable into the mixer. So I can get MIDI, audio streaming and everything uh, just by a USB cable. So it's really quick and easy to set up. And I can address all of these units individually from my computer through the mixer. So I can send a, a MIDI melody to the TB3, I can control uh, my VT3 for the vocal melodies and stuff like that and just uh, run tracks separately from Ableton, for instance, like I'm doing now. So I can easily add some beats here. Uh, my Ableton is actually playing on full blast, so everything is playing now. But I'm muting it here. And I can also, uh, for instance, add some uh, uh, individual filtering. Things like that. And uh, also, what makes it... Another thing that makes it really unique is that I have a, uh, this, this step-based effect here. And I can use that for sidechain compression, slicer and, and filtering. So, I can activate, activate it now for the TB3. And now you hear this sort of filter jumps. And I can obviously control that pattern myself, so I can add a few more. And uh, I can do the same thing with the drums, but maybe I can want another effect on that one. So. Uh, here I can have some slicer, and obviously I, again I can slice it as I wish. So I can go here and just remove a few. And again, my DAW is playing full blast all the time, and I'm just controlling this. Um, also, I have scene memory, so that's really cool. I can, I can recall all of the settings uh, in my scene memory. Uh, all the filter settings, all the levels, all the mute statuses and everything. And uh, for instance, I have my break here, but I know if I press scene 2, everything is going to start playing on full blast, like this. 3, 4. I also have a number of really cool global effects, like uh, uh, rolls, for instance. And you can switch these on individually for each channel. So m now you might hear the vocals are still normal. Then that's because I've switched it off for the vocals. Uh, I also have a um, uh, beat crusher, flanger, filter, high pass filter on the way up, low pass filter on the way down. And all of these uh, uh, different effects have subtypes as well. So, for instance, if I take the roll, I also have uh, a tape stop there. And very unique also is the combi effect, which actually uh, puts uh, these, all of these effects on different steps. So it creates a very animated uh, changing effect. Uh, so let's uh, just have a quick listen to that. So really easy to lie mix. And um, uh, I can stream up to 18 channels from my Ableton or Logic. And uh, let me just uh, sh give you a short uh, live mix with uh, some different scene changes and filter changes and stuff and just show you how easy it really is. So uh, that's just a quick example of what you can do with the MX-1. And uh, thank you very much, guys.